Y'all, we got the homie, man, Black, he speaks, man. He's talking about the Juice Word leaks are insane. Now, this is funny to me because literally last week, we all had a conversation about, um, you know, leaks. You feel me? I made a video about because Polo G had came out and tweeted and said that his leaks are crazy right now. He said he probably one of the hottest rappers with the crazy leaks. You feel me? And I'm like, nah, Juice Word is probably the number one artist right now. With the crazy leaks. Now, Blackie Speaks made a video about the Juice Word leaks are insane. So we about to see his take about it, see what's going on. Um, yeah, I know Juice Word got a lot of unreleased music, you feel me? And I'm guessing a lot of people is leaking his music though. For sure, for sure. You feel me? I don't y'all know me. I don't listen to unreleased music, so I don't really be in that um that community like that. But we about to see what uh Blackie is talking about with this with this take right here, man. The Juice World leaks are insane, man. Yeah, I know Juice got the number one leaks right now, bro, going crazy. And then people saying it's Polo G and stuff like that. Y'all let me know who leaks are insane. You feel me? Y'all let me know in the comments. But let's dive into this right here, man. No, right. these Juice World leaks are insane, bro. Seriously. As some of you might know, Juice World's music has been subjected to a lot of leaks for some time now. The leakers have been getting a hold of Juice World's music. They've been putting it on the market and have eventually been selling it. I have a couple of things oh, to say about this. Oh, yeah, that's another thing, too. They, yeah, I did hear that. Like, right, right. Juice World music is literally going for like 10000 bro. Now, that's crazy. Niggas is really making a profit off that, bro. Now, all jokes aside, though, that's not cool, though, bro. Bro, bro, that shit not cool. I understand how you trying to hustle and all, but bro, that's not cool, bro. That's not cool. Come on, man. You feel me? Have some type of respect, bro. For real. Seriously, as some of you might know, Juice World's music has been subjected to a lot of leaks for some time now. The leakers have been getting a hold of Juice World's music. They've been putting it on the market and have eventually been selling it. I have a couple of things to say about this entire thing, though. So, yeah. Let's talk about it. Now, Juice World, I still see your shadows in my room. The last time I spoke about the late, great Juice, I talked about what was really going on with his music. His forthcoming album, which originally had the Party Never Ends title, got delayed. Fans got promised a single that didn't drop. And then Lil Baby, of course, took the blame for all that. Oh yeah, I did hear that. My fault for pausing. This is gonna be my last time pausing. But I heard that Juice World dropping a new track on the 12th. Baby said that he's dropping a new Juice World track on the 12th. So y'all let me know if that's true or not in the comments, man. Knowing Bibi, we probably won't go get that track. Did the documentary drop too? Like, what's going on with the documentary? I know he said that he's going to drop the documentary first and then the album. What's going on? It's about to be the summer, bro. Single that didn't drop, and then Lil Baby, of course, took the blame for all that. The fans are just hungry for new music, right? After the success of Legends Never Die, which dropped in the summer of 2020, people want another album. Now, there's two types of people the people who want new music and uh, leave it at that, and then there's the people who want new music and eventually come up with a plan on how to get that music. That's right, leakers. The other day, there was a little auction slash group buy going on on Discord. A bunch of people came together, aka the leakers, and Juice World's music was being sold on there. The leakers posted a screenshot of the chat log, and as you can see, if you're looking at the screen, if you're driving, keep your eyes on the road, the chat log says, record of most dropped in a group buy, $10,000 held by me, total amount was 22k. I'm actually not sure how this uh, auction or group buy, whatever you want to call it, goes down, but from what I've heard and seen myself, a bunch of people apparently come together they all agree on a couple songs they're trying to buy and uh, they all pitch in and essentially start raising money to buy whatever song we're talking about how exactly juice's music is even ending up on a market like this honestly i have no clue but what i do know and you probably know as well music getting leaked isn't that foreign of a concept we've seen a lot of artists become the victims of mass leaks and have essentially had their entire projects leaked for the boy juice world's music though it's been extreme i mean juice's music has been suffering from some major Major leaks. Like I'm talking a lot of music getting leaked and eventually ending up on a market and eventually getting auctioned. Altogether, apparently $22,000 was the amount that was raised in this group buy. One individual ended up raising over 10 k for this group buy slash auction, whatever you want to call it. The CEO of Grade A Productions, the label Juice was signed to, he caught wind of this group buy and swiftly had the Discord server where the group buy was going on shut down. After this happened, one of the leakers responded back to Pete 
that's the CEO's name, threatening to leak a couple songs. Pete, you have 24 hours to reinstate our account. Nah. So Rita, adore you, already dead, relapse. These are songs, by the way, and I go hard, we'll all leak. Now, after this, DJ Scheme, you guys know DJ Scheme, right? Good friend, the late Juice, he put up a tweet saying, just promise me y'all gonna take this album to number one for bro and his family, regardless of the leaks. That's Obviously, a fact. this is a pretty unfortunate situation we have right here, if you ask me. Personally, I've never been a big fan of leaks. Word. I don't seek them out. I don't listen to any i'd rather just wait for the music that's, that's just how i roll that's, that's just how too. i've always felt towards leaks personally i've never found them too appealing honestly and i guess part of the reason why leaks are so enticing is because you're listening to something you're not supposed to listen to since it hasn't officially been released to the general public you're out here bumping this you know song by juice world who other people can't listen to and then when the song eventually drops you can go ahead and say oh man i was listening to that way 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 back are you just now hearing the song ha Joseph. Yo, I tell you, yo, people really, this is, this is people in real life, bro. They rather listen to the leaks and the song actually come out. They'd be like, yo, I already heard this, bro. Like, you, you mad late. You feel me? How am I late? Because you listening to leaked music, bro. Like, come on now. <laughs> It's really people out here like that, yo. It's, it's crazy. On you, nigga. There's also obviously the monetary incentive, like in this case. If you can somehow be the original source of the leak, you can make a little bit of money from it, like people were doing in this situation. That aside, I think these Juice World leaks are insane, though, man. I'm not sure how it's gonna affect what the album actually ends up sounding like, but depending on the amount of leaks we see from this point forward, it could for sure affect how the album actually ends up performing. I hope that's not the case, but hey. You never know. But yeah, the Juice World leaks are insane. What can I say? Do you personally have any thoughts on this entire situation regarding Juice World's music essentially being put up for auction? That's kind of what's going on here, right? With that being said, definitely let me know in the comment section below. And uh, let's have a discussion about this. Damn, that's really insane, bro. Like, that could really break or make an album for real, bro. Because if you leak every song, right? And the album come out, people is really not gonna tune in like that. You feel me? They gonna be like, oh, I already heard this already, y'all. Y'all mad late? Da da da. You feel me? So regardless, though, regardless, man. Whenever this Juice World albums drop, we gotta take this to number one, man. Cause Juice was a phenomenal artist, man. Um, and we gotta do this for his fans and his family, bro. Like, come on, y'all. Let's do that. You know what I'm saying? Let's do that, man. Regardless of the leaks, regardless of you know whatever's going on. In a way, it's music. Whenever this album drop, y'all, we taking this album far, bro. Facts. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts in the comment section down below, man. If you enjoyed this, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new, man. I'm out of here.